Hey guys, welcome you all in a new video. And if you're watching this video, then I'm sure your Samsung Android smartphone has been locked due to forgotten pattern lock, pin lock, or password lock. Like this, you can see here the Samsung, both are the Samsung Android smartphones. Samsung and Samsung, you can see here both the smartphone is of Samsung brand. Now you can see here if your phone is locked due to forgotten pin pattern or password lock like this uh, and you, you are unable to unlock your smartphone so I will show you how you can uh, unlock your Samsung Android phone of any series without visiting any service center. Firstly uh, you will have to, uh, your phone will be uh, locked like this, firstly you will have to uh, uh, Firstly, you will have to switch on your Samsung Android for, uh, smartphone hard reset mode and you will have to uh, do the factory data reset of your smartphone. Firstly, I will show you how you can do this. Firstly, you will have to uh, switch off the uh, smartphone. Now you can see here it, it's, it's asking uh, password here. Simply you will have to plug your data cable to your smartphone. Now, after this, simply you will have to press the volume up and down button and the power button at the same time to switch off your smartphone. Press and hold until it's complete switch off here. You don't have to release your uh, any button until you get a charging uh, animations here. Now you can see here you are getting here charging animation here okay but still you will have to wait until you get a such type of animation here when you get a such type of charging animation here you will have to press the power button and the volume up button at the same time to switch your phones to the hard reset mode you will have to press the both the button at the same time and you will have to press and hold until your uh, handset uh, hard reset mode switch on here Now you can see here your phone's hard reset mode has been activated. You will get a lots of options. Simply you will have to select the wipe data and factory reset here and you do have to click on the power button to select this factory reset option. When you will click on this, you will have to go to the factory data reset here. Now your phone's factory reset uh, option has been completed. Now simply you will have to reboot system now. Click here. Now your phone's hard reset mode has been completed. Now after this, I'm going to switch on this uh, Samsung Android smartphone. When your hard reset mode will be completed, you will get a such type of user interface here. Now here, if your phone is locked due to forgotten pattern lock and uh, password lock, when you will go with this option, you will get an option of a Gmail ID login. I mean to say, if you have remember your Gmail ID and password, you can easily uh, log in here and uh, uh, go to the uh, your home page of your uh, Samsung Android smartphone. I mean to say you don't need any problem. You don't uh, you don't get any problem here. Okay, but if you don't have remember your Gmail ID and password, so I will show you how you can bypass this uh, FRP here. Okay, so simply you will have to. Some uh, viewers says that you are getting here accessibility option. It means your phone is already unlocked. Your your video is fake. So I am going to show here. You are getting here accessibility option. Simply I am going to click on this accessibility accessibility. You can see here you will get a two option and you can't do anything with these option. Okay. Some viewer says that uh, you are getting uh, accessibility accessibility option. So your uh, Samsung Android smartphone is already unlocked here. So you can see here you can't do anything here. Okay. Now, after this, simply you will have to go to the start button and you will have to click on a start button. When you will click on this start button, it will show you like uh, here. Simply you will have to check all these options and go to the next. Now, after this, simply you will have to follow all the step uh, with patience because it's a time taking process. If you don't want to visit your service center and you don't want to pay uh, expense here, you will get a such type of option. Simply you will have to click on don't copy here. Now, when you will click on don't copy here, you will get a such type of option. Okay, you it, it will ask you your pin pattern or password lock. Okay, but if, if you don't have remember here, simply you will have to go with this use my Google account. Simply you will have to click on this uh, use my Google account option.
now you can see here it's asking for your gmail id and password so if you have remembered gmail id password so you can go with there but if you don't have remember your uh, gmail id and password you can see here there is no any skip option so i will show you how you can get a skip option from this page okay uh, so after this uh, you will have to go with the back option again you will have to go with the back here again you will have to go with the back okay again back here now you will get an option of a uh, here english language simply you will have to change this language from india to uk check out here now after this simply you will have to click on this start button now check all these options and go to the next go to the don't copy here now you can see here it's again asking here pattern lock so don't worry at all simply you will have to go again with the back button and again one time back here now you will get an option of a wi-fi adding network simply you will have to click on this add network and you will have to click on this setting okay and you will have to reset to default setting click on this option and reset keyboard setting here clear personalized data go with the back here now you will have to change here language switch off to us switch on uk go to the back option again back here back again back here go to the next don't copy here now let's check what happened now you can see here my friend you are getting here a skip option now here you can skip this option i mean to say you have completely frp bypass here okay so simply you will have to go with this skip option again skip here more accept here If you want to use new pin pattern and password so you may apply from here so i still now i will uh, skip here skip next now you're all set up it means your work has been completed now simply you will have to click on this finish but one more thing i would like to tell you my friend if you have used this method so within one hour you will have to use new pin pattern or password lock okay otherwise your phone will be again locked with the previous pin pattern or password lock okay so after unlocking your smartphone you will have to quick use new pin pattern or password here now finish and finish now you can see here the samsung android smartphone has been completed unlocked with the help of frp bypass i mean to say if you don't have remember your gmail id and password so don't worry at all by this method you can unlock your android smartphone without gmail id and password okay so if your smartphone is unlocked with the help of this video then do the like this uh, like this video and if your smartphone could not unlock with the help of this video then make us comment which type of issues you're facing in this problem our team will quick response on your issues within one or two minutes thank you so much see you in the next video